What's up, you guys? Alright, so if you saw my video on the Crafting Dead, I'm going to show you how to install it if you wanted to try it out for yourself. It's a relatively easy install. Um, there's only a few basic things you'll need. You'll need Rizigami's Mod Loader, the uh, Crafting Dead itself, and uh, either WinRAR or 7-Zip. I'm not going to post a link for that due to uh, personal preference as well as computer specifications. So you can just type that in and find whatever WinRAR you need. So first thing we're going to do is you're going to go to the pages. I already have them open here. I've already downloaded this stuff, but I'm going to show you where to go. So you're going to come down here, and you see right here where it says download. Just click File Mirror. It's going to take you to an Add Fly page, and then you just click uh, after the five seconds. You go ahead and click that, and then uh, click go ahead and download. Um, that one, boom, you're done. Okay? Then you go to Rizugami's Mod Loader, and uh, starting from the top, you're going to go down, and it's going to be the first one right here. Mod Loader. Um, you can either do AdFly or Direct. AdFly is one with, uh, it takes five seconds, but, you know, hey, it helps out the mods, gives them some, uh, gives them a couple of extra spare cents. But however, however many people download it, you know, I'm sure they're making decent, but just like the help out every once in a while. So once you have those, it's going to look something like that. Bam. Alright. So next thing you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and bring up a command prompt. Well, not a command prompt, but press your start button. Type in percent app data percent. Hit enter. It's going to bring you to your roaming folder. You're going to want to go into Minecraft. I would recommend making a copy. I don't take any fault for what happens to your Minecraft. So, yeah. You're going to want to go ahead and go into bin. And then this is where you need uh, WinRAR 7-Zip, which actually for these two and this, you're going to go ahead and right-click, open with WinRAR Archiver. Okay? So now you, you're inside of your .minecraft jar, or your minecraft.jar, and uh, before you install any mods, you always want to delete this, meta.inf. If you don't delete that, your mod won't work. So you're going to want to go ahead and you're going to want to delete those files. Alright. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to open Mod Loader. We're going to slide it over. And just simply highlight. Drag and drop. Okay. Done with that. Boom. And you're going to open up Crafting Dead version. And then you're going to want to go into Place into Minecraft uh, Jar. I believe it is. Minecraft. Yeah, Minecraft jar. Um, highlight all of these. And go ahead and drag and drop again. Okay. Uh, oh, whoops. I did not mean to exit out of that. Um, by the way, guys, you can usually get a 40-day free trial on this. See, I have 19 days left to buy a license, so that's nice. This one is place and resources. You're done with your Minecraft.jar. You're going to want to go back to your dot Minecraft file. You can either go to your uh, you can go to your bin and just press up here. Go into your bin. I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> Stay right here. You're gonna look for the file the folder resources. Go inside of that. Bring this up. Open that. And then you see gun. Go ahead and drop gun in there. Then you wanna go ahead and exit out of that. You can go ahead and minimize that just to make sure we didn't do anything wrong. You're gonna hit run. Do, do, do. All right, log in. Now, right about if you got a black screen and it just stopped, it means you installed something wrong. You might have forgot to delete meta.inf or uh, some other thing like that. So then, you're gonna click single player, create new world. You're gonna go to more world options, world type, super flat, large biomes. There it is, crafting dead. So, uh, let's go ahead and do hardcore, because, you know, hardcore parkour. And it's going to load up the world. It's going to build the terrain. And if you installed it, well, I mean, you've already installed it correctly. Your Minecraft's working. But, um, yeah. So, thanks for watching, guys. Whoa. Everything's so good looking. I'm not used to running it on this.